Dow Jones ETF. This is the one that goes up with that Dow Jones all-time breakout back above the 200-day, hitting that top in resistance. We started buying over here after we got the retest of the low. We went up, then we confirm it when we got above that 100-day, and now we're above the 150-day and going up above the 200-day right there. So this is going to be the wall of resistance. We have bought puts on the diamonds when we were going down here. We held the double bottom. That was the October lows. And the Dow Jones index, well, that was up beautifully, 828 points. And the ETF, the diamonds here, they go straight up along with it. We bought the call options. We can show you how to do that because that's what we do. And not only that, though, what I can say at this point, we are overbought on the diamonds. Now, we still have this resistance and we have a Fed meeting next week. We've had that breakout rally when we held the bottom. That was our second entry, buying the diamonds and holding them. And that was the Dow 30 stocks reported great earnings. And that is the biggest part of the move. Now, we'll guide you into every trade. And yes, you can get in the live trading room, sign up for it now. A lot of people were underinvested and they bought the Dow 30 stocks. Some people were so far pessimistic that that is when rallies happen. We called the rally. We went up nice. There is another higher right there. It will be that trend line. That's the neckline right over to the, the other part of the chart. You can see it. So, listen, we are phase one overbought on the diamonds, and we are. So, we've had the great big move. We have the options expiration Friday today. That's out of the way. So, we went ahead and we sold into the move because the rally has been substantially good and has entered into an overbought.